Audrey and welcome back to our vlogs. Today I'm here with my sister Jordan. Jordan from Just Rather 3 and Jordan May Williams. And today we are going to be doing a makeup tutorial. We haven't done our makeup on our videos for a while, but I thought it would be fun to do a little switch up. So we're going to be following a makeup tutorial, I think by Nikki Tutorials. And Literally. we are going to be trying to follow it with only audio. So we have no visual aspects. What? We just have to be listening to her voice and following it. And I have no idea what the final makeup look is supposed to be like. Our mom actually picked it out for us. All I know is that the makeup look is actually an no. anime look. Anime. I don't watch anime. I know what anime is, but I have no experience with makeup with anime or like anything with that sort. So this will be super interesting. Um, and I'm, I'm ready to get started. So are you ready to get started? I'm so ready. Here we go. I hope she gives thorough instructions. I hope so too because I'm not the best makeup person. Yeah, okay. I just so do the same thing every day. I'm gonna press play and then set it down. On Instagram and kimchi and just anime in general and it's freaking me out a little but I'm here to learn and try and here to learn and try. <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna do with this is like skin is gonna be most easy step for me because I can just do what I always do. I don't have to worry. I don't skin? have to be scared. Go, skin. Skin. The simple step of the day. Now, in Wait. the extreme anime transformations, Pause. I see that people block out their brows to completely cover them up and create a Pause. set of new brows for them. She said she's gonna do her simple makeup skin every skin. day. Which, what is that? We have no idea what that looks like. I'm just doing for my me, makeup skin. For me, my makeup skin is literally doing nothing. Like, I do nothing to my skin. I only do things to my eyes. For me, my makeup skin is I do nothing unless if I have pimples, which I do. So Jonas put it and on. I, then I put on concealer. So I'm just gonna do nothing because I literally my makeup routine for skin is just leaving it. So alright, you done with your She just said she also said block out your eyebrows though. Did she say block out your That's eyebrows? That's what I heard. I'm gonna do it. Okay, ready? Themselves. I'm not gonna do that. I feel like I want all it. this sort of illusion to be right here as just kidding. Wait, up here. Where? Time for a nice mix of foundation. Mix of foundation without that foundation! Okay, so she said she wants all this stuff to look somewhere and not somewhere, which we have no idea what she's talking about. She said foundation though, so we'll put on foundation. I have foundation that we can use. It's uh, rusty, crusty, dusty. Oh, but no. I also have these cute little heart sponges, so I think it's very fitting we should use them. Okay, we're going this crusty, dusty um, uh, foundation that has expired probably like three years ago. So this should be really <laughs> healthy for our skin. Oh no! I also know how to apply I have foundation. This huge pimple right here, by the way, and it's like, like it feels like a bruise and it hurts so wow. bad. This is full coverage, baby. Oh no! I've never used foundation. I've seen beauty gurus do it like this though. Oh, I just put it on. Oh, I made a heart on accident. That's cute though. I put it on the sponge. In conclusion, I don't like foundation. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's why, what I discovered from this. That's why I still it have a lot. It just feels annoying, and I feel like you can achieve the same goal through concealer, but you know. Conceal your whole face. You do you, boo. I'm not a makeup artist, so I have no idea what I'm talking about. But now I just feel like I'm paler, and my freckles are like pretty virtually gone. Well, I feel like my pimples are gone, so that's fun. Not me. Well, you need <laughs> three dimensional, baby. Oh. <laughs> Concealer ah! time. Concealer. Wait, that's all she says. Oh, she okay. just says concealer time. Wait, where do I put it? You never told me where to put concealer. I'm guessing that the concealer goes under the eyes because I've seen that before. I know. Look I'm how dark my concealer is compared <laughs> to your foundation. <laughs> this is my, my concealer. Is so much darker. Oh, we use different brands. I use the brand. Wait, Urban why is mine so much darker? Wait, mine's more red. That's why. You but use see, it's way more. We red. use different makeup brands. I have a lot of Urban Decay stuff. <laughs> Did I look so different? Mm, I feel like kind all of. dark facial features are gone. I'm just like a blob. Yeah, I feel like I have no character to my. Yeah, face. it's just all like a circle. And I'm going to set it and forget it using the Fit Me Loose powder by Maybelline. Set it and forget it, baby! Set it and forget it! Okay. Powder. Uh, can I borrow yours? Mine is the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Pressed Powder. It's not translucent loosen powder. Wait. It's not translucent powder because I don't know what that is. But we've got pressed powder here and it's from Walmart because <laughs> we're I'm not really, bougie. I'm not bougie when it comes to powder. I really don't care when it comes to powder. 
Also, we're gonna share, which is kind of nasty, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> okay, so who is ready for a crazy reveal? Me. I did some work off crazy camera reveal. to Wait, gather my thoughts and... Lady. Hello. So Hello. this is wildly inspired by Miss Gay Matt on Instagram. He is a drag queen that is known for this eye look. He's also the creator of the Brits I don't know what it looks like. And I feel like I kind of changed and altered it a little to make it more oh, anime. Okay. The first thing I did was Wait, so she already did one of the eyes. That. Oh, prime. 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 Ah. Now I'm going to go in with a brown warm brown. Easy. Stretch out where I want my new crease to go to. Bro. New crease? Bro. So she's going new with a brown. Crease. But she didn't tell us where. We just have to come up with where we she think said, the new crease is. Wait, she, she said, so I'm assuming the eyes are going to be much bigger than... I don't know what an eyes. anime character looks well, like. Well, I think their eyes are normally bigger, but why didn't she block out her eyebrows then? What? <laughs> How do you make a crease? Bro, don't ask me. You have got more experience than me. <laughs> uh, bro. Uh, bro. Bro. I'm making my crease very defined. Like, that's my crease. I'm definitely creating a lot of space here for a new lid. I'm kind of following the hollowness <laughs> of my actual bones. Like where my brow go. bone starts, sort of in that <gasps> hollow is where I place this line. And please don't worry if you don't get this super, super oh, at no. the first go because we're just going to sketch it out and blend it out. And then we're going to carve the lid out with concealer again to get it nice and tight. <sighs> Well, she just told us that uh, this is supposed to be. Uh, I told you it was our eyebrows. I literally told you. <laughs> well, she said she put some concealer. <laughs> more concealer! More concealer! Because she needs to make it snatch. I'm leaving it here. I'm putting on concealer. I'm not putting on any more concealer. My eyeballs already feel like they're drowning in concealer. What's the next instruction? And then on a oh. buff and blend BB14 brush, I'm going to buff this out using the same color. What? It's so a blendy blendy time. Blendy blendy time. All right, she's blending it now. I'm just going to use my blendy brush anyway with the same color. I'm just going to blend out what I already got. You know, too late to blend. It's a freaking line now. Like, <laughs> like... It's like a, a solid boy gun. line. So I'm just focusing on blending this out and getting it nice and soft because this is essentially going to be your new crease. Picking yeah. up a lighter, warmer shade as a transition. What? Making it even softer. Oh, more blending. Take another brown. I ain't all about that. I'm done blending. <laughs> and now taking a darker brown and darker really brown. going in and intensifying that detail. What? Darker brown. I use my darkest brown. All right, so now that we've got the base Bro. crease done, it's now time to clean it up and carve it out to create our new lid. What? Clean it up and carve it out. Like, literally, how do you carve it out? Setting it with a shimmery white shadow. Shimmery and white shadow. all the shadows I've been using so far are by Juvia's Place. And I'll put down below in the description box what exactly I'm using. Okay. I don't have a shimmery white shadow, but I've got a highlighter, which is what I'm using. I'm going to use this one. This is very, very super light. Like, you can't even probably tell on your face, but that's my <gasps> most shimmery white shadow. Whoa! I see a new eyeball. Wait, what? What are you talking Can about? I close my eyes if I draw eyeballs? <laughs> it's now time for the black eyeliner and we're gonna cover the entire lid as you can see and I have a nice little trick for that to see how far you can go so you what? take the liner and you're gonna put it on the base of your lash line okay look up that line is gonna show you how far you have to go at least to not get any transfer so this what that line is gonna be my guide Hold up. I don't have any eyeliner. <laughs> All right, here is my eyeliner. 
Wow, it's very exaggerated. I went for a um, bigger wings. <laughs> <laughs> Do I use um, eyeshadow? But it's hard because yeah, I had to use eyeshadow because I don't got anything else. So okay, liner with a black shadow, also by Juvia's Place. Using a nude eye pencil, I'm gonna sketch out my brand new eye. And you wanna let what? it start what? from within that new inner corner, dragging it down, what? creating a nice little tear duct point area, and then we'll see. Wait, we have a new eyeball? <laughs> Wait! I'm a feeling Wait. This, is, this is the crease we should have done. Oh, we messed up! We messed up! Since this is the crease we should have done our eyeliner on our crease, not our actual. Wait. Not our actual crease, the second crease that we made. Ah! <laughs> well, now I have little circles under my eyes. Like, it look like I have bags underneath my eyes. I look like a granny! Yours just looks... <laughs> you have tiny eyeballs. <laughs> Ew, stop. I'm gonna leave it. It is what it is. Kind of following the natural socket of my eye. When I squint, my eyeball kind of pushes out. Right underneath. <laughs> this is where I want my new eyeball to be. Uh, wait, underneath. Taking right. those browns again yeah. and acting as if I'm applying <laughs> eyeshadow to my lower lash line, although my new lower lash line is right there. This look is gonna look like trash until the last step. So trust the process. And also, it's supposed to be up here. Chance. Thank you. Just taking that warm sort of orangey color that I applied as a transition shade in my new crease. <laughs> this is the color I'm using to blend the brown out with. All right, time for the no! I'm gonna carve out the whites of my new eyeball. This is a Krylon TV paint stick in white. And oh. I'm just gonna apply it right there and leave a little ball pupil open. Okay, you know. And for that, I'm gonna use concealer. Oh, I'm gonna use this, but it's like Ew, gone. nasty. I'm gonna use concealer because and I'm just gonna fill in the region of my new eyeball that I know is fake because now our new eyeball has winged eyeliner on the top of the eyeball. It should be, okay, it, the eyeball should be up here. We've really done mess up. <laughs> we did done mess up. All right, we're back. It's just getting worse and worse, but let's continue. What's she doing for her pupil? pupil? I can't tell. Like, what is she doing? She's just setting that with a white shadow. I already did that. With the Urban Decay Razor Sharp Liner in the color Revolver, I am drawing in a new pupil. Oh no. What's Revolver? And then because I naturally have bluer eyes, I'm gonna take a little bit of this <laughs> eyeshadow topper, and a holographic eyeshadow topper by Barry M, and this is in the color Asteroid, and what? just tossing this in the middle makes it so pretty. So on the other hand, what? This is where I'm at. Oh no. <laughs> what are you doing? Ew, <laughs> what is that? This. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, look at the viewfinder. This is my new eyeballs. They do not look good. <laughs> like guys, we I are look seriously like trying. A clown. We're I'm, seriously trying. We're trying. This is actually way, way harder if you don't get to see the video. This is my eyeballs. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. I don't look like an anime character. There's no hope. This is no, okay, let's finish this. Let's just speed around the rest. And a little let's bit of go. dark blue liner right here where the new eyeball is, like the pupil. Dark blue liner? I don't have that. Gap of skin. <laughs> All right, time for additional shading and highlighting. This is what's really gonna bring this eye to life. So with that nude pencil, I'm just gonna carve out the white of the eye into an actual eyeball shape because right now it's a little weird. Oh, already I'm done. Done. <laughs> Done at the bottom. Done. Easy. Done. So we're going to add a nice glare of wetness right here on the actual pupil, like I did over here. A it what? will make the eye look more realistic and wet. And just dots of wetness like you would see in your own eye. Okay, sis. Oh, no. You're putting on actual water? <laughs> hey, she said dots of wetness. 
<laughs> I only am realistic here. You have to put it in the eyeball like it's your actual okay, eye. Now for the yeah. fun part, the lower lashes. These are elegant lashes. Now she's crying. Two, Look at that. Tears. I got lashes. We can put on eyelashes. Yes. We're putting these on. Be right back. All right. So I we both have different methods. I put mine right here. This is my new eyeball, and so I assume this would be my top lashes, so I put them right here, but Jordan, I put them <laughs> <laughs> on my actual eyelash line, <laughs> because the eyeball is like this. Your eyelashes don't go down into your eyeball. They go up, <laughs> so, but I don't know how to put on fake eyelashes, so it is what it is. I hate these eyelashes. These are so, oh, let's just move on. This video is taking us like two hours. You know, it's so oh funny goodness. when I close my eyes, it still looks like I have eyes. Hello. Okay, so time for Not blush. Me. And I, think I want to do it. a blush. nice subtle like blush. pop of pink blush. going from the no. eye onto the cheek. From no. the eye to the cheek? From the eye? Do you have blush? <laughs> and also a Lady. little bit onto my temples. Temples? Oh boy, that's a lot of blush. I'm gonna contour my nose to make it look as tiny and cute and anime as possible. I'm gonna pause her because she's going way fast. <laughs> <laughs> we got so many different approaches to this. A little bit of highlight. Oh, that's highlight. a lot. Highlight? For lips, I'm gonna do a nice gradient nude lip, so what? I'm gonna try. Nude lip? I don't got no nude lips. All right, let me put on a wig and I'll be right back. What? And there it is, guys. I am now Love Nikki sister from Nation Earth. <laughs> Nikki. <laughs> oh my God, was it a struggle bus to get here, but I am loving this extreme anime transformation. Again, I want to thank Love Nikki so much for sponsoring this video. I'll leave all their info down below. Don't forget about the giveaway and don't forget to check out their game. Thank you for giving me this okay, inspiration pause. for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. If you did, all right, we are gonna put on wigs and come back, show you our final look, and react to how ours compared to Nikki's. Oh no. Here is my finished anime look. Don't mind the wig, it was literally the only thing we could find. This is what it looks like. I bet it's so close to hers, like, matching. <laughs> All right, Jordan, what's yours look like? I don't have a wig, so we're going Ew. all natural. It looks so crusty, dusty. Oh, oh it's poking me in, in the eyeball. <laughs> Anime. Anime. Okay, we're gonna be we're gonna be reacting to what the actual one. Oh my gosh, our faces. What we the actual so one looks like. No. <gasps> Wait. Are you kidding me? Turn up the brightness. Turn up the brightness. Hold your horses. Oh, it's definitely not what ours looks like. I mean, kind of. No, she looks so much better. We did it right, except ours just looks like the way, like way knockoff version, and ours. But looks we put things really in the right spot. But we. Yeah. Did. Oh I my god. Solid wow. win. I think we could. Passes anime I girls. Know. Wow, we're so anime. Anyways, guys, that's it for today's video where we try a makeup tutorial with only the audio. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. Also, comment down below how we did. And your Who personal won? Opinion. Who won? Who won? Who Let won? us know. Also, remember to subscribe if you haven't already. And you know what time it is? Random gets insane.